Hi, I'm Spundy, and today I'm going to go over some great holiday gift ideas for the bass player in your life. The bass guitar accessories landing page on Sweetwater.com at the time of the recording of this video has 687 different products. So I'm here to hopefully narrow that down a little for you. As always, if you have any questions about these products or want more ideas, give your Sweetwater sales engineer a call. First off is the fret wrap. I really like these. They're kind of nifty little things that help deaden the strings a little up towards the top of the bass. Um, and if nothing else, they just make you look cool. So they make a great little stocking stuffer. The Unitune clip-on tuner is really, in my opinion, the best clip-on tuner for bass guitar. It picks up the note really quickly. It works really well. I've got like 12 of them, which is kind of a shameful amount, but you realistically need like one for each bass. Otherwise you just lose them. But they also are a great stocking stuffer. A variety pack of picks is a good call as well. If you don't know what type of picks somebody uses, then you can't really go wrong with a variety pack. You can never go wrong with a good standard padded leather strap. If somebody doesn't already have a good strap, this is just a good standard padded leather strap. What better to go with your new strap than a set of strap locks. Strap locks help you not drop your base, so they're great. Strings are also a great stocking stuffer. I personally use NYXLs for most of my bases. I really like them, so chances are, uh, if somebody hasn't tried them before, they're a good upgrade, they're something different, try those. I like them. The 45 to 100 is a standard set. I also make them in five string sets and six string sets as well. Hercules makes great guitar stands, and this one is a great guitar stand. Makes a great gift as well. Next item is just a good standard setup kit for guitar or bass. I've got like two or three of these things and they really are the best bang for the buck. A good accessory tray is awesome to have at a gig. Uh, it's good for holding picks, uh, beer, accessories, your lyrics on your phone, even if you didn't bother to actually memorize them. So it makes also a great gift or stocking stuffer. Nothing beats a good solid DI box. This is better than the cheapest DI boxes, but also not the most expensive DI box we have. So it's a good stocking stuffer in my opinion. If the bass player you're buying for has a mic in front of them at shows for singing or I don't know, telling jokes, and they don't you know, need a place to put a drink or hold their phone or whatever because they actually memorize lyrics, nothing beats a good old fashioned pick holder. We could all use more storage space. I'm especially bad about this. So nothing beats a great guitar rack. This PV combo amp is great for, you know, taking to a practice space, leaving your living room to practice at home, or even small gigs as well. Does the bass player you're buying for just have their pedals strewn about on the floor or some old undersized pedal board? Well, getting them a good upgrade is actually a great idea. And this one comes with a hard shell case. And don't forget the power supply. The Zuma is a great upgrade if somebody already has a power supply for their pedal board, or if they just need one to go with the new pedal board you got them. Zuma makes a great option. This is my favorite bass compressor pedal, and it also is a limited edition option, so it would make a great holiday gift. What makes a great gift? Well, I think something that somebody would use and appreciate, but maybe not necessarily think to buy for themselves. So, I think the U-Bass is kind of a really cool little gift option. This, or like any other kind of acoustic bass, is, is kind of nifty, and it's one of those things that I'd never think to buy, but if somebody got it for me, I'd totally use it all the time. This is kind of like getting a Mercedes Benz on Christmas. Who out there is just randomly buying their significant other a Mercedes as a gift anyways? Well, picking out a really expensive base or car is a very personal process and people generally are very particular on that. The idea of making such a large financial commitment for a gift is kind of ridiculous, but according to consumer psychologists, lots of people not only indulge each other during the holidays, but themselves as well. So maybe you should treat yourself this year. Next up is another big gift idea. And to be honest, if somebody's really into a specific brand, like me, for instance, I love Spectre, they would probably be pretty stoked to get a really, really, really nice one for the holidays. Uh, for instance, like a USA built NS2. So Sweetwater does sell band orchestra instruments now, and a lot of players used to play upright in high school and college. So maybe this year you should make it a December to remember. This is a little ridiculous to be honest because it is a refrigerator size purchase and costs more than your average refrigerator. But really you can't go wrong with getting any bass enthusiast a legit heritage edition SVT rig. So that's it. 
Don't forget to double check all of your musical and non-musical gifts this year. Some gear does require batteries, power supply, a case or cables or other items I haven't thought of to complete the experience. If you have any questions about these products or need more personalized gift ideas, give your Sweetwater sales engineer a call today. Thanks for watching.